Hi, I'm going to tell you that 17 times 23 is 391. Okay, I've given you the answer. That could help you work out a different question. What about 170 times 230? Well, the answer is going to be bigger. How many times bigger than 391? Well, this has made it 10 times bigger, and this has made it another 10 times bigger. So the answer is going to be 10 times 10 times bigger. That's 100 times bigger. 39,100. What about 17 times 24? Well, 17 times 23 is 391. We need to add on another 17. Here we have 23 lots of 17, so 24 lots of 17. Let's take 391 and add on another 17. 7 plus 1 is 8, 9, 10, 408. What about this one? 391 divided by 23. Well, we're working backwards. You know 3 times 7 is 21. That tells you that 21 divided by 7 is 3. So 391 divided by 23 is 17. How about 1.7 times 2.3? This time the answer must be quite a lot smaller. Well, this is 10 times smaller, and that is 10 times smaller. So the answer is going to be much smaller than 391. It's going to be 10 times 10 times smaller. That is 100 times smaller. 391 that sounds about right. We've got one and a bit times two and a bit makes three and a bit, nearly four. It's about the right sort of size. Now, let's try these three questions. Again, we know 17 times 23 is 391. So 170 times 23, well, that's 10 times bigger. The answer is going to be 3,910. Now, look at the second one. 17 times 23 is 391. What's 17 times 2.3? Well, this one is 10 times smaller than 391. Divide it by 10, you get 39.1. And the last one. This one is much smaller, 0 0.17 times 2.3. So it's going to be something like 391, but that's much too big. This is making it 10 times smaller, and this one's making it another 100 times smaller. So now we need to divide the answer by 10, 100, 1,000. 10, 100, 1,000 times smaller, 0 0.391. Right, here are some different ones to practice. This time we're told that 43 times 19 is 817. So have a go at each one of those, and we'll have the answers in one moment. So, the answers. Number one. This one is much bigger. 43 times 19 is 817. 430 times 190, this must be 10, 100 times bigger. So that's 81,700. Number two. So this one is rather smaller. The answer is not 817. This time, 19 has become 1.9. That's 10 times smaller. So the answer is... 10 times smaller, 81.7. Okay, number three. 817 divided by 43. 817 divided by 43 must be 19. Again, we're working backwards. And number four. So look, again, the numbers are quite similar, but they're much smaller. 
The answer is not 817. It must be 10 times smaller and another 10 times smaller. So the answer is 100 times smaller. Divide by 10, divide by 100, 8.17. Okay, download the worksheet and give them a go. Good luck.